Hello to all the homos out there. I'm going to talk to you about Don't Ask, Don't Tell. Yeah, I know. It's a big topic. Everyone's talking about it. But here's the thing. I do research. I actually... Like, find out things. And there's things I've already known about for a while. Everyone saying Don't Ask, Don't Tell was created on um, the idea of discrimination, la di da di da di da di da When in reality, Don't Ask, Don't Tell was actually also created to protect against discrimination. 20 years ago, if you wanted to join the military, one of the questions you were asked is if you are gay. And if you are, you cannot join the military. In 1993, I think it was, when Don't Ask, Don't Tell was passed by the Clinton administration. That was making it so they could no longer ask if you were homosexual or not. And you are not to be prancing around. But in all reality, if you're just prancing around like little fruit, then you're kind of just annoying. Seriously. Gets annoying. Um, I mean, I know people that are gay in the military. And they don't exactly hide it. But they aren't going around, oh my god, so I suck dick all the time. You know. They're still sophisticated and act maturely, and that type of thing. So, Don't Ask, Don't Tell wasn't completely based on the idea of segregation and discrimination. It was actually partially to protect against discrimination against homosexuals. Now, let's face it, we still want to get rid of it so that we can be openly gay, have feel free to be in gay relationships, have a husband or a wife if you're a lesbian. You know, that's your free will. But, it's like, people need to do their research, you know, claiming all this crap. Acting as if they're all knowing. No, they're not. Let's face it, I don't like Don't Ask Don't Tell either. I'd rather just have everyone have the right to be who they are. At the same time, I can respect Don't Ask Don't Tell because it used to be worse. I mean, sure, I'm still in the generation that's too young to know about these things because I was three or four when Don't Ask Don't Tell was made. And all the new generation doesn't think, maybe I should research this stuff. Maybe I should find out more information on it. Maybe I should use my brain and think. Whole weird concept right there to actually think. So yeah, I encourage you all to use your brain. Think. Do your research. Would you rather just be automatically declined because you're homosexual? Or be given the chance to not be a flaming queen and do what you want? Or a butch man woman? For all you lesbos. Old dyke, there we go. <sighs> You don't have to act a certain way. You don't have to talk a certain way. You don't have to go out and get a fake boyfriend or girlfriend depending on what gender you are. You don't have to fake anything. All you have to do is not go around talking about who you fuck. But honestly, I don't care if you're gay, straight, bi, or wanna have sex with a fucking tree. 
I don't want to hear about your sexual exploits, even if you aren't in the military. Okay? I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear you going, oh my god, so I just got blown by this hot chick. Okay? I don't want to hear that from a straight guy, and I don't want to hear, oh, I just got blown by a hot guy from a gay guy. Okay? And I definitely don't want to hear, I just fucked a tree and I got bark on my dick. Okay? I'm a tree fucker. I don't know where that shit came from in my mind, but it made sense. It's like, don't go around talking about who you fuck, because honestly, not everyone wants to hear it. So if you're, like, civilized, then it doesn't matter what sexual orientation you are. Under don't ask, don't tell. And that's why it's not discrimination, because it doesn't matter. If you can go without ex going all crazy over the fact of, oh my god, I suck dick, and I don't like it, then it doesn't matter. Sure, it's still slightly discrimination, because if you are like that, then they can kick you out. And that shouldn't happen, and that's why they're trying to get rid of it, but people need to realize it could have been worse. So, yeah. Things are bad, but they have been a lot worse. So, yeah. I think people need to just do their research. Stop over-exaggerating things. Sure, I want Don't Ask Don't Tell Gone too, But, at the same time, I'm sort of thankful it exists.